Hello, in this video, I'm going to be talking about the Schminka Haradam Aquarel Ultimate Mixing Set. Schminka is a German brand. One of their recent products is the Ultimate Mixing Set for Haradam Aquarel Professional Grade Lineup. Now, this is a 2022 limited edition set. According to the uh, marketing materials, Schminka collaborated with New Zealand painter Evan Woodruff known for his use of bold and vibrant color in his abstract work. He had suggested nine half pans that will complement the regular normal pan sets. In total, there are 18 half pan slots, meaning you can add another nine slots for pigments of your choosing. The colors included are Turner's Yellow, Transparent Orange, Quinodricone Magenta, Potter's Pink, Cobalt Violet Hue, Thalo Sapphire Blue, Cobalt Azure, Viridian, and Perlin Green. Personally, most of the nine included pigments choices are not pigments that I would choose for my work. But I wanted to try them out. Another aspect of why I chose this palette set was the functional design of the palette. The palette measures some 13 by 10 by 2.3 centimeters, making it bigger than a regular 12 half pan paint box. However, smaller than the longer 24 or 48 half pan paint boxes. So the size is rather in the middle of all these regular paint boxes. The paint box design wise, the exterior of the paint box is a semi-gloss showing the satin finish of the metal. I can see some transparent coating being implemented to prevent rusting while the inside is with the usual glossy white. The top cover is designed with some extruded parallel long thin bumps or ribs and when open functions as a general mixing surface with long parallel thin valleys or trenches. Upon some use, the parallel trenches made some sense in controlling pigment mixes not to be too free-flowing. And when the mixes dry, part of the mixes are deposited in these long trenches. The other painting surface flips out to reveal eight compartmentalized 20 by 29 by 3 millimeter mixing pan areas. These are perfect for pre-mixing large volumes of pigments for bigger areas. The painting capacity, I can place in up to 21 half pans or 9 3.2 ml full pans. The placement of the modular pans are the usual friction fit metal brackets that are attached to a removable metal plate bottom. As for brush storage, you can store one small size or medium size travel watercolor brush like an Escoda number no. 8 round and will not fit anything bigger like a number no. 10 or 12 travel brush. Any pental water brush cannot fit in this compartment, unfortunately. So in conclusion, I love to be able to travel and have more paint choices. And this set's pigments are interesting, like the vibrant transparent orange, cobalt azure for some sky delineation, and even the perylene green was great to use for some intense contrasting. This is great as an everyday carry watercolor kit. This goes well with my 12 by 16 centimeter watercolor sketchbook. Packing everything into one small set with travel or water brushes with some rubber bands. However, it is heavy when fully loaded with pigments and not easy to hold while painting with a sketchbook when you are just standing up to sketch. You would need to have some steady surface to prop on while painting. The integrated thumb or finger loop at the bottom does help to secure 
holding the set. For quick sketching, I found securing the palette's inner mixing surface with thicker rubber bands to the sketchbook back cover seems to do the trick. Overall, I love the refreshing palette look, functionality, and choices of unusual pigments for the mixing. So I actually appreciate the uh, experimentation with the included pigments just so I can somehow evolve beyond my usual color schemes. I have been used to all these decades of painting watercolor. So to me, it's a very good buy and I, I really love the design and the compactness. So it's not too small and not too big at the same time. So overall, I love this set and I'm guessing I'll use this more for my studio setup uh, because I do not have a big area for working with watercolor. Thank you for watching.